Everybody knows that no food's permitted during the class. And still, who doesn't want to break the rule? Watch this video for a few tricks on how to sneak a snack into class. Sometimes I want to chew on something during class. I've got apples and my friends got candies. But the teacher isn't happy to see a little picnic in her class. Would you like a piece of apple? She seems to get nothing except knowledge. Remember well, no foods allowed in class, at least for the students. Do you think it's a colored pencil case? It's actually not. Let's see what's inside. We'll need a colored pencil case. Cut off the top part of a pencil. Repeat for the others. Hot glue the cutout to the top part of the case from the inside. Attach all the others in the same way. The case looks like it's full of pencils. Open the bottom. Put in a bar of chocolate. Close the case. It looks exactly like it used to. It seems my friend can't open her colored pencil case. I offer her mine, but she isn't going to draw. There's a dream of a sweet tooth inside her case. Oh heck, Miss Smith has noted it. You should have broken off a little piece. Well, here again, you're well aware that no food's allowed. Does anyone see? Aha! While they are busy mocking me, I'll snack on their chocolate. Teachers sometimes need a sweet compensation for their students' behavior. Do you dream of a portion of french fries or a juicy cheeseburger during your long classes? Take bright notebooks shaped like a pack of french fries and a cheeseburger. We've shown how to make them in our previous videos. Miss Smith wears glasses. She thinks we've got McDonald's here. We assure her it's nothing like that. It's just our weird notebooks. It's a kind of Mac school. While Miss Smith is cleaning her eyeglasses, we change the notebooks for the real snacks. Mmm, what crispy french fries and a tasty cheeseburger. Are you eating again? Oh yes, it's your notebooks. Okay, continue writing, girls. They are so creative. This marker doesn't write. Is it another prank? No, it's my way to sneak a snack into class. Take off a plug from the marker. Remove the filling. Clean the inside of the container. Put in gummy bears. Set the plug. My friend tries in vain to write with my marker. I explain it's not for writing. It's a place to hide my little gummy bears. She likes the idea so much, she's left me an empty marker. I managed to sneak sausages into my art class. How did I do that? Here's the hack. Put a sausage in a Ziploc bag. Heat a knife above the flame. Cut off the bag to fit the sausage size. The hot knife seals the package while cutting through it. Take out a few wipes from the pack to get some free space. Tuck the packed sausages in it. I like to eat my sausages with some sauce. Let's disguise it as gouache. Fill a clean gouache container with ketchup. Put on the top. Add mayonnaise in another container. Be careful not to mix up the sauce and the paint. The gouache and a pack of wet wipes are usual supplies in painting class and no one suspects there's something else inside. I take a sausage from the white package. My friend is bewildered. Why did I take a sausage into class? Am I going to use it as a still life object? I dip my sausage in the dark red gouache as it's not paint, but actually real ketchup. Mmm, tasty. Hey, be careful not to paint with mayonnaise. Is it a pack of chocolate clay or a bar of molding chocolate? Let's clarify it. Take out half of the bars of molding clay from the package. Remove the gloomy colors. Leave the bright ones. Prepare the place to put in your Milky Way. Lay paper on the bottom. 
Put a paper strip to separate the modeling clay and the chocolate. Take off the wrapper from the chocolate. Place it instead of the clay. Is this Twix too long? Cut off the excess. It's okay now. Close the pack. Here's a trick. There's modeling clay on one side and chocolate bars on the other. Miss Smith is too tired with us, so she's gone to sleep. Wonderful! Here's an opportunity to snack. A pencil sharpener is another cool hack to hide candies. No teacher would guess to peep inside. We'll need a sharpener with a big container for shavings. We'll use it to hide Skittles. Remove the sharpener. Put in the candies. Set the sharpener back. Put on the top. My friend wants to sharpen her pencil. She reaches out for my sharpener, but I can't let her reveal my disguise. Okay, take it, but be careful. She opens up the sharpener and a color rainbow of candies immediately scatters out. Miss Smith is alert, but while she's putting her glasses on, we manage to tuck the candies into my mouth. My friend begins sharpening her pencil. Phew! It seems she hasn't seen the candies. A lipstick is the best camouflage for candies. Put the sweet colored mints of Tic Tacs into a clean lipstick container. Put on the top. It's time for makeup. My friend applies her EOS balm on her lips. I give my lipstick to her to test and taste. Miss Smith wants to be beautiful too. She takes a mirror and puts on her red lipstick. Food is prohibited in class, but makeup's not. Oreo instead of wet wipes is another hack to sneak food in class. Take a few wipes from the pack to get some free space. Open up a package of Oreos. Wrap each cookie into foil. Make a few big silver coins. Put them into the white package. Attach the flap back. Does your friend need to clean her hands? Attention, we've got a special offer today. Open a white package and take an Oreo cookie. Do you still need a wipe? Go and wash your hands. Take a break, get a snack. Eat your cookie while Miss Smith's dozing off. Is it a glue stick? No, it's a cheese stick. We'll need a thick piece of hard cheese. Take a clear glue stick container. Press it down to cut out a cheese cylinder. Repeat to fill the whole container with the cheese. Close the cheese stick. My friend needs glue for her paper craft. Don't take this stick, it won't help. Smell it. There's cheese inside. Be careful, Miss Smith can notice it. Let's eat it when she looks away. Take chewy candies to get a light snack in class. We've disguised long licorice candies as pens and pencils to prank friends in our various videos. Today, we'll use them to have a secret snack during the class. Put a pen cap on the licorice candy or a pen end decoration. Put the candy pens in a cup with school supplies. Has your pen stopped writing? Take this one and get a snack. And if you've got a bad habit of chewing on your pen, we've got good news for you. You can keep gnawing these candy pens whenever you like. Treat your friends and no teacher can notice it. I've got a secret file. Few people get access to it. We'll need beef jerky and sliced cheese. Take a file folder. Put the beef jerky into a sheet protector. Add the sliced cheese. Close the folder. While my friends keep an eye on the teacher, I take the meat and cheese out of the folder. It's okay, Miss Smith's napping again. If only she wouldn't smell our snack. What a lovely bookmark. Oh, it's a gummy candy. 
These sugar-sprinkled gummy strips look like pretty bookmarks. My friend's stomach growls. Don't worry, take my writings. There's a special bookmark inside. I'll certainly remember the place where I stopped to get a snack. It's old-fashioned to write with a ballpoint pen. Use this upgrade to turn your pen into something else. Remove a ballpoint refill. Put in a crispy cookie stick. Make a whole set of the special pens. My friend takes a pen out of the cup, but it doesn't write. Certainly not, there's a cookie stick inside. Be careful to take crumbs off your writings. You won't have to sit in class with your stomach growling. Choose any of these hacks to sneak food in your class. Write in your comments how you managed to cheat your teacher. Subscribe and click the bell. Ding! It rings to begin a Troom Troom funny lesson.